How you feeling, Tony? Awesome, man. Yeah? yeah you ready wait. for this? Yeah, look at the weather. It's beautiful out here today. It's different than last year, eh? Yeah. <laughs> totally different. This is enjoyable. <laughs> I remember this time last year we were contemplating whether... Yeah, five degrees with like sleet coming down. No, and beautiful. roads were closed. Yeah. I hear a lot of complaining. It makes it sound like you guys did something terrific last time. <laughs> we did. We did. But it'll be more terrific this year. Uh, yeah. You all set? Wait. Yeah. What about you, boss man? Hey, I feel pretty relaxed this morning, uh, riding with a couple of veterans here, you know. <laughs> but that's okay. It's, it's going to be a fun race. Today's fun. Yeah. All about fun. I'm not going to kill myself. Well, I'm going to get back to you on that opinion. Yeah, yeah, I'll get back to you. <laughs> We're going to take uh, another interview here in about yeah, three hours. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
Hey buddy. Come on, man. I'll be there and I'll explain paradise roll or chicken fast. Chicken fast is it's not easy, it's longer, but it's like a, a single track in the, in the forest. Uh, 
you can pass each other over there, so you cannot, it's not gonna stop <laughs> at the chicken pass. The Paradise Road can't stop, like proper stop, like <coughs> you just undress yourself and you wait till the end of the race. So if you, if you ride the zigzag and the zigzag is easy, like boring easy, <laughs> you can go to the Schmitz Paradise. If you have like a little, little difficulty in the zigzag, don't go in the Schmitz Paradise. format of the race is uh, this is the expert race the afternoon and you can see there's bikes lined up all the way along here here with Chris and so the way the formatted work format work last year you would qualify according to class but this year you qualify overall so I'm 54 and uh, then you just go so the way this works is we had to hunt down all these people in front of us <laughs> every single one and um, we start off, how many, how many seconds between? Uh, we're uh, 15 seconds between each rider. Okay. So between riders 16 and 17, there's a minute. Okay, so, so we're about five minutes behind, yeah. which is fair, because we want to give the top guys like a good five minute head start. Yeah. You don't want to, yeah. you know, otherwise we'll get called sandbaggers. <laughs> so, <laughs> no, the guys here are crazy fast. It's going to be awesome. Uh, last year, we only finished one lap. So anything beyond that is yeah. pretty epic. Goal is two. Goal is two. Um, I'm gonna keep going until I can't. I gotta do some serious passing, bro. <laughs> <laughs>
I think I'm in about maybe 30 of plates right now, or possibly 20 dollars. Maybe more, I don't know. Coming up to the uh, rock garden. And a few bales here and there, but overall, not bales, but like just put down. Overall, I'm feeling pretty good. But I got another lap in me at least, so hopefully a lot of people uh, checked out after the bird pop. We've been uh, there are lines. It's really nice. Look at this. You think it's nice? Oh my god. I wouldn't know you're in Hard and Go right now. It's pretty well made, but beautiful. I have to say, I'm absolutely loving this tendon gnarly with the super PSI. Holy smokes, I can just kind of get a ready thing. So I'm trying to keep a measured pace, keep my heart rate down. It's usually working, no one's passing me, so.
it's all new from last year. I don't remember this at all. Really nice. Brandon team did a really good job this year. Huh. Got a fan this year. First time having a fan, what a difference it makes. There's one technique I would recommend if you love the hard enduro. Just really get used to those small flips where you raise your front wheel because you need to get those in dialed in really well for these little rocks and logs to come up and you never know when they're coming. You need to be able to fire it into that like this. See what I mean? I never saw that before and you need to be able to spring up up those things otherwise you're gonna be stuck there for 10 minutes holy geez look at this view beautiful man this is cool wow just epic thought I didn't turn my GoPro off This is just awesome. So beautiful. This trail alone is worth the drive right here in this section. We're coming up to the rock garden. Second gear right now, if anyone's wondering. I got my clutch in all the way. Just feathering the front brake, a little bit of tapping on the back to slide my bike around when needed. It's back there, so you're just kind of sliding. And then front again. Take your time down here. Yeah. I 
like to say it's not a race, but it is a race, so it just doesn't look like one.